these ceremonies are often quite moving and not so much for the for the graduates themselves but it's always enthralling to watch the parents and the family and the friends and you can tell just by the looks on so many faces that this is such an important day and it's uh, it's a very emotional moment and uh, I love stepping in and being a part of it. It's just a huge honor and a great privilege to receive an honorary doctorate from York University and to do it at the Kellogg Schulich EMBA graduation is a tremendous thrill for me. I'm humbled by the experience uh, but it also has given me an important reflective time to think about the career and uh, that I've had and, and the kinds of things that I've done. I've been to this campus many times and I've always been inspired by what goes on here and how York has grown as a university. So this is very, very important to me and a very great honor. It was just so pleasing to see all those young people, men and women, being recognized and York is playing a key role there. York University is one of the fastest growing universities in Canada and uh, it really encompasses uh, in their student body, the whole world. Well, I think Toronto is one of the great multicultural cities in the world, and York is one of the great multicultural universities, and people come here from all over the world. And it's something that, you know, the entire province and the country is very proud of. York University is a place of great learning, uh, great teaching, great experiences. They are uh, not only accessible, but they pursue excellence. Uh, they're growing in stature across the country, uh, internationally. Um, they are demonstrating that they are a modern university in a modern time. For the students who graduated today, I'd like them to remember that they're change agents, that they have a chance to shape the world in front of them, that they have a chance to shape their businesses, their lives, their communities, and they should seize that opportunity. We all know that the future is unpredictable. And I think the main message I have is, is that you, no matter how many plans and aspirations and good ideas you have, you have no idea what's just around the corner.